Houston meteorologist Sarah Gannon joins us in the studio with your weather authority forecast and just sunshine day. It was beautiful <laughs> out today. It certainly was. Mm -hmm. Hopefully you're able to get outside, soak up that sun, get a little yard work done, whatever it was to get outdoors. It's pretty fantastic all across the area today. Good news is that does get to continue into tomorrow. Out the window right now, we're looking at temperatures in the lower 80s in Rochester with very light winds, dew points pretty comfortable into those lower 60s. And we're looking at mainly sunny skies here as we check in with a live look from our live camera from Assisi Heights looking towards the west there. So few clouds, but otherwise pretty picture perfect. We are going to continue to see beautiful conditions into your Monday. Great start to the work week. But as we head into Monday night and especially into Tuesday, looking at the chance for showers and thunderstorms to return to the region, you may have to watch out for a severe threat to be present in the area. So we'll have to monitor that situation pretty closely. But as we head towards the late week, then temperatures are going to be warming up quite a big bit maybe taking a run towards 90 degrees in some locations. But currently here at home, we are looking at those temps mainly into the upper 70s, lower 80s, 75 in Preston, 81 in Osage. Same for Mason City, Albert Lee at 79 degrees in Austin at 81 currently. Dew points very comfortable as well into the upper 50s and lower 60s, almost like a fresh breath of air out there uh, as you enjoy the outdoors. Not as humid as what we have been the last couple of days. And things are staying quiet here at home across the upper Midwest with high pressure in control, so that's why we get to to enjoy these quiet conditions and sunny skies. As we kind of time things out here for the next 24 to 48 hours with future track, things are going to stay dry and quiet for tonight. We will have to watch out for the potential of maybe some areas of patchy fog to develop during the overnight hours, and that may impact uh, your morning commute a little bit for tomorrow in some locations. But as we start off your Monday morning, we'll see temperatures in the upper 50s, lower 60s by the midday, seeing those temperatures uh, warming up then into the 70s, topping off for the day into the lower 80s. But again, Again, beautiful sunny skies across the area. As we head into the overnight hours, we'll see clouds building back into the region, bringing some chances for some showers and thunderstorms uh, to the region. As we head towards Tuesday, though, that's going to be the more likely chance to see some widespread showers and thunderstorms in the area. And uh, both uh, Monday evening and into Tuesday, presenting the threat for maybe some severe weather to keep an eye on. So in terms of Monday, marginal risk so far. So level one out of a level five for uh, the northern portion of the viewing area by Tuesday, then kind of looking at uh, more broad scale across the entire area. So we will have to watch out uh, both days to see uh, kind of what plays out here. The ingredients are there. We'll have to monitor that situation up pretty closely. So for tonight, temperatures will be back into the lower 60s. Pretty clear, quiet for tonight. Hopefully you can get a campfire in uh, before you head off to bed tonight. But patchy fog may be possible in some areas, especially low lying areas. We are not going to be seeing uh, much for wind here tonight. But tomorrow, plan on some beautiful sunny conditions heating up a little bit in some areas. Look to see those highs topping off into the mid 80s. 83 for Plainview, 85 in Zimbrota, 84 in Dodge Center in Rochester, Austin and Albert Lee with mainly sunny skies. Checking out to our south and northeastern Iowa plan again. Looking at that sunshine, have that sunscreen handy. Mason City topping off at 85, 83 for New Hampton, Cresco at 81. Your extended forecast showing beautiful sunny conditions into Monday with storm chances moving in from Monday night into Tuesday. Tuesday looking to be the coolest day of the week, but we'll see temperatures gradually warming up as we head towards Wednesday and Thursday into the mid 80s. The upper 80s returning to the area for Friday, Saturday, maybe taking a run towards 90 degrees once again. But for the late week, maybe looking at some very isolated chances for afternoon showers and thunderstorms. All right, thanks, Sarah. Next in sports, some prom.